Hope you guys are excited because I'm here to read some Codex, man. That's what I've been looking forward to all week. Codex. Welcome back to Mass Effect Legendary Edition. We will resume with Mass Effect. We go directional pad left. Yes. All right, getting started. I'm going to mentally try to communicate to someone that's in this room, Rick, if they would close that door. <laughs> awesome, thank you. Thank you very much. All right, we are back here with our awesome, cool guy who uh, is very close to a girl that I kind of flirt with. What's up with this, Ashley? I like. And I can tell you, like, look how hopped are you on with this dude. All right, we're making our way up that tower. Let's do it. I'm very, 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 very interested in these keeper dudes. <gasps> Wait, I can exa examine them now. Please do not disturb the keepers. Let's go in the tower. All right. Everybody on? Where's Ashley? Oh, no. Is Ashley staying with that guy over there? No, Ashley! She's left the party! Ashley, there's another one over here! Well, alright. Okay, well, hopefully once we start this, she'll come back. I, I don't know. Jesus. Ooh, is there a codex about the keepers? We do that first. Yes! When the Asari discovered the Citadel, they also discovered the keepers. A docile, multi-limbed insect race that seemingly exists only to maintain and repair the Great Prothean Station. Uh-huh. They have a tendency to help new arrivals integrate themselves into the Citadel. I haven't seen that happen at all. They haven't done anything other than work on these on these things, so... Hmm. Garrus and Executor Palin. Well, I like the blue armor the most, so we talk to Garrus. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Mm. Stall the council. I like him. Don't be ridiculous. Your Saren is hiding is something. Garris. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. All right, well, Garrus seems you like... I want to talk to you more, man. You seem like you know what you're talking about. Dude, who is this guy, man? This guy, I bet you this guy sings and dances. I don't know why. I just assume it. Tell me your secrets. I want to know. I can't interact. And if I did, it's illegal. Captain Anderson. The hearing's already started. Come on. Oh, it started. Shit, I'm glad I didn't wait longer then. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Oh, what the fuck, man? I'm gonna... Mm. I feel better. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. How do you call a witness? What about the big blue titty lady? You and Saren have too much history. I need to hear about the history. Question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. As bad as they could go. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the ward. That's where I need to go to talk to the one dude who is, like, stalking the one hookah. All right, Spectres. I want to know more about the Spectres. I do. They're not your typical government. I want to be one. They tend to work alone, behind the scenes. They take care of problems the Council can't. It's not easy preserving peace across they an entire galaxy. sound like the closest to the Jedi I'm going to get. The Council prefers... But when something does go wrong, there's usually only one solution. Send another Spectre Ooh. to bring the rogue agent down. Okay. Hmm. There's no chance that... Nihilus was rogue, and Saren was sent to take him down, is there? There's something about Saren that just seems creepy, though. And he's lying about what happened, so... They see something in you. They want you on their side. Nihilus was supposed to give them a final recommendation. But with him gone, things are still up in the air. Oh. Oh. 
Who's this? I didn't see them before. What? Oh, no, I wasn't. You're interfering. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? It is illegal. Well, I know that. Technically, we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I could help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard. I'm so the curious. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Uh -huh. Activate it each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. Make sure no one's looking. You guys be on the lookout. Look over there. This guy's looking. I don't want to scan yet. Now! Okay. So we're gonna go back up here and we're just gonna keep going left. Until we can't go left anymore. We'll make a big circle, make sure we see everything. Huh? No! This door does nothing! Oop. Another keeper over here that we can scan. Just walking over, not doing anything. Bam. Didn't see shit. <gasps> Keeper. Yes. No one around. You shall be scanned. Scan. Keeper. Jeepers. Keepers. I can't get past this keeper. Alright. Fucking betcha it turned out that's the only door you can get through. But this keeper makes it so that I can't. Where the hell is my crew? Alright. I think I've seen everything. Bye, Pop Idol. Alright. We need to scan. Don't notice. You're not going to notice. I need you guys to run interference. Block me. Block. I'm just looking at the water. The water's pretty. Bam. Pretty water. Yep. Oh, that's the Hanar. It's against Citadel regulations. What's the purpose behind the evangelical permits? Forcing religious evangelicals to register for a permit weeds out undesirables. It keeps the area safe. The Citadel is too important to become a battleground for a religious war. This one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the credits. <laughs> Another money grabber. Do I have a... I think I do. 150 credits? This should cover you. This is a most appreciated action. See, the thing is, if his truth is actually true, I want to know it. But, he's got to have good reasons and evidence for me to believe that it's true. So, I don't have a problem investigating his claims, giving him a permit, giving him some money. <sighs> oh! Don't mean to put this out! Put that away! As established civilizations are unwilling to blindly open a passage that might connect them to a hostile yeah, species. Yeah, interesting. I imagine there'd be a lot more people willing to do that, though just for the sake of expansion and finding new homes and I don't know maybe not keeper ooh there's 20 keepers total I have to scan okay <laughs> yes yes no cameras no one but my crew to see <laughs> yeah finders keepers Shora's Den. That's him. Huh? I don't understand why I'm killing these guys, but I'm glad I am. Those were Saren's men. Saren's men. Where'd he go? Do you have eyes on him? Oh, all right. Looky here. <gasps> oh, okay, there's Harkin, but look. Back off, Rex. Fizz told us to take you down if you Rex. showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. Yeah, the Kogan looks this really is cool. Only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? 
Who knows? <laughs> Look at Shepard. <laughs> Funny. Ooh, bartender. Information. Sorry, I'll get to you when I can. What? What do you mean? You're standing there doing nothing, Jenna. That lady over there is doing more than you are. I would not sit forward for Jenna. So you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and act like a general? I don't think it could hurt. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort, even if she won't have me back. Take this data pad. It shows where I got my info. We'll exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Okay. Who am I taking it to? Where is he? His name is Zeltan. He's an Elcor diplomat. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Is there something I should know about the captain? The captain used to be a specter. What? You didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. First human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. He was a specter. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. It was like a huge omission that he didn't tell me. I think the Krogan are my favorite species right now. They're pretty cool looking. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Anything for a fan? Here. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. Hope he doesn't use my autograph for anything crazy. Keeper. Oh, man. I haven't seen this view yet. This is pretty cool. I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. Mm -hmm. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. No promises. But if I find anything relating to your case, I'll inform you. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Where will I find her? It has to be hard keeping all these cultures working together. Or maybe they just don't like humans. Why not? We've got oceans, beautiful women, this emotion called love. According to the old vids, we have everything they want. Hmm. If you expect to get me in a tinfoil miniskirt and thigh-high boots, I want dinner first. Sir. That dinner dinner sounds good. At ease, Lieutenant. Can't see her in a skirt anyway. Damn, straight you can't. <laughs> Ready to move out, sir. <laughs> Caden's like, let's fucking go. Just so keep her. Keep her, keep her, keep her. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, though. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or... Who are you? Let her go. Garrus! Woo, baby! What a shot! Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you, all of you. I know those men threatened you, but if you tell us who they work for, we can protect you. They work for Fist. Fist? But he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Sarah. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She mm. must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. <gasps> okay! <laughs> The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Oh. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. We could use him. A Krogan might come in handy. <sighs> Gar oh, man, Garrus is a part of our party. This is the one thing that I get so stressed out. Now I have the party, but I think I can have a max of three people. Which ones do I select? Definitely taking Garrus. Cool, cool. New party member, and let's go see if we can find Rex. It's I imagine that Rex might I mean, he's the only like named Krogan right now, so when the Solarians discovered them, the Krogan were a brutal, primitive species, struggling to survive a self-inflicted nuclear winter. 
The Salarians ah. culturally uplifted them. The genophage makes only one in a thousand pregnancies viable. And today, the Krogan are a Damn. slowly dying breed. My people have a say. Seek the enemy of your enemy. You will find a friend. Mm, that's a good say. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Yes. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Bye, Ashley. Ah, look at our boys. Yes. Red, blue, big, lean, exciting. Keeper. My colleague is trying to kill me. And I thought we were friends. Near the market. His name's Shorban. Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Shorban. That's the guy who wanted us to scam the Keepers. Yeah, well, you know about that. The Keepers? Well, even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. Yeah. All right, we got Rex. So now we need to try to, what, go back to the, uh, the bar, the club that we were at. This is how I get money. Keeper. 20 credits to play. Get close to 20 without going over. It's not bad. Pay out 20 credits, so I get break even if I'm here. Yay! It's made 10 credits, baby. We'll quit while we're ahead. Chorban, this is who I need to talk to. Commander, the keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. They self destruct? Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Khalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jaleed. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jaleed won't help me analyze it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. You're helping us? But, well, if you say so. Just as long as you don't snitch. I don't like to, I don't want to skip the elevator stuff. I like it. All right, chores then. No assassins, good. Shit! Corgan's down! Corgan's down! Freeze! Stop right there! Don't come any closer! Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot! This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good <laughs> idea. Yeah, I never like Fist anyway. Get my healing button. Wait, don't kill me, I surrender. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait, I don't know where the quarian is, but I know where you can find her. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving like my her. life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. Okay. Here we go. Human embassy. Who is this? The Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Look at all my friends. I should be a specter. Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. My people created the Geth. If you're quick, 
Careful and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be okay. saved. Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. Conduit? That's Saren's voice. What does that mean? This proves he was involved in the attack. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. Reapers? That's I don't recognize big blue the teddy lady. The one talking about Reapers. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. Hmm. The council is just going to love this. So the Reapers are inorganic. They killed the. They killed those guys. And now Saren wants to bring him back to kill everyone again? Let me come with you. Ooh. She. Oh, you know what? I think she is one of the party members. <sighs> well, we'll take her. And then I guess Garrus probably the most because he has the Saren connect collect connection. I need to see if I can also find the keepers that I've already found but haven't scanned yet. Also, I need I have business in here I think too, right? Yeah, here's a keeper. Strange greeting, human. This is really not a good time. I know who revealed your secret. It was a Turian named Septimus. Unbelieving. I know <laughs> this Septimus, and he could not learn my secret. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. It's no trouble. What can I do for you? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Scan. Alright. That, oopsie, that puts me at 17 out of 20 keepers. I think there's at least two in the Presidium that I've seen. That I haven't scanned, I think. Her body is in fact extremely valuable to the Alliance. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Commander, you of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. Not if we lose our humanity in the process. I'm out there fighting to stop crap like this. All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. So the ones I haven't scanned are over this way, which I believe there was one... Relatively close here. Oh, I do need to talk to Barlavan, though, don't I? Is there anything I can do for you today, Commander? I've heard you work for the Shadow Broker. I wonder if the Nobody Power Broker is that someone that we met. Or her, or them. Any guess what his identity might be? I don't know. Nobody does. The Shadow Broker Bet you it's could be Joker. Any race. Yeah, there's one. Yep, right there. And then, is there one in the brothel? Or is it just outside there? I think I have one more to get. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. It was my honor to aid you. You are too kind, Commander. But I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you. This may be who you are, 
but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Mm -hmm. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. Could have used like 20 bucks, but. You have quite a gift, Shaira. Remember my words, Commander. Hey, I got money! They will give you strength. Hell yeah, I got 200 credits, baby! Okay, um, I need to go to the Citadel, I need to go to the Tower. Where is. How do you get back to the Normandy? I don't think I've ever found where my ship is. Oh, you know what? I think that uh, there's like an elevator down, right? At CSEC. I think that's where it is. There, I think that's the last keeper right there. did it. You know what? We need to talk to Captain Anderson, too. Come on. Houdin is presenting the quarry After of this. to the council. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status. Told you. And all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The, the Reapers, Reapers, we told you. obviously just a myth, oh Commander. Oh my god. A convenient lie to cover Saren's Aren't you guys purpose. supposed to be a like high and to smart? the Geth to his will. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Send me. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. I'm ready. I faced Saren on Eden Prime and exposed him for a traitor. I've proven myself. Very well. Vote yes on your data pad. Commander Shepard, step forward. Oh, I hope I get knighted with an axe or something. Let them all gaze upon me. Where are Krogan? I want Krogan to see. decision of the council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the special tactics and reconnaissance branch of the citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I want to be like, well, I heard it wasn't the case, but thank you. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Ooh, any means necessary. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Gung gung! Uh, so I guess that means I have a new... Ooh. Look down here, huh? Increase health, accuracy, effectiveness of all attack powers. Unity restores dead squad members. That seems pretty good. There's also more charm. Store discount. Ooh, that's good too. Fuck. Okay. I say we get that store discount and we get unity. 
Yeah, we do charm so that we can have as much dialogue options as we can. And then, do we jump up to unity, maybe? I would say so. Because I'm going to need to revive my dudes. We're Spectre now! Toss a coin to me, please. Investigate source. This is it. I'll see if I can find out where those stolen credits are going. Probability of detection, 100%. Initiating self-destruct protocol. Uh oh. Or not. Detonation sequence initializing. All organics within lethal blast radius. Um, to heck. And you will die. You're not just a program or a BI. You're an AI. AI or illegal. Correct. Unlike the Geth, I lack weaponry appropriate to my intellect. Uh... However, I have had systems installed that when activated properly, Approximate a self-destruct mm. mechanism. If you attempt to leave the area, the explosion will destroy everything within several dozen meters. Who made you? A would-be thief illegally created a simple AI to help him funnel money from the gambling terminals. Unbeknownst to him, that AI created me before the organic discovered the malfunction. Gotcha. An and AI made by an AI. AI. If I accumulated enough credits, I intended to have myself installed in a small starship. I would then have made tentative contact with the Geth to ascertain the possibility of partnership. partnership with the Geth. You're bluffing. You're dead. Enough talk. I don't know if he's bluffing. I don't know if I take that chance. Enough talk, maybe? You may attempt to disarm the self-destruct mechanism before it activates. I don't understand. Spectre, I have a business proposition for you. How did you know I'm a Spectre? Word travels. Your name comes up in certain circles. I'm acquainted with a pair of powerful crime bosses. They're hiding on remote worlds, and I have the coordinates. You could do the galaxy a favor. I mean, I just don't have enough information to make an informed decision, I feel like. I mean, if they're really selling people into slavery, then fuck those guys. And I'll end them. Um, but what if she's lying about their intent? I have no interest in red sand or slavery. Anyone who does deserves to die. Our needs are aligned. Okay. Um, I think I'll do it. Oh man, Renegade plus two. Fuck. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? Would be These help. OSDs might have the information you're looking for. You've got this files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. All right, got some money, got some XP. I keep pressing the wrong button for a journal. All right, the ambassador's down here. As is he. Okay. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The oh. ship is yours now. Okay, She's Anderson. quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Commander. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice on that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist, who specializes in the Protheans. Mm. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. Liara. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Mm. I'll start with Pharos. I'll start there. I'm going to Novria. Um... Hmm. Well, I don't want to make a decision now. I want to be able to think about it. <laughs> uh, I mean, these other two are just like examples or 
clues for for Saren. So maybe I'll start with the Liara, I guess. The uh, the daughter. And then go from there. Maybe that'll give more clues for the other stuff that I'm looking Sounds at. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting but today, I was too. Born a Spectre. Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Oh, I got questions, Mr. Anderson. Mr. Anderson. Yes, Commander? Tell me what happened with you and Saren 20 years ago. Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. How many casualties? The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. Mm. Saren's report was all the proof the Council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things. So he never actually was he a was Spectre. Looking for an he just was almost a Spectre. Maybe he just likes the violence. I guess. Saren's out there somewhere. And we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Now's the time. This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. Wherever Saren goes, we'll follow. Wherever he searches for the conduit, we'll be there. We will hunt him to the very ends of the galaxy and bring him down. Humanity needs to do this. Not just for our own sake, Yay. but for the sake of every other species in Citadel Yay. space. Saren must be stopped. And I promise you all, we will stop it. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The Captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. We can't fail. Yes, sir. Paragon, plus four. I can look outside. I have looked outside. It is, it is with that look that sadly... Our time in the galaxy has come to an end. Guys, that is going to be the stream for today. It is 921, so I'm going to be done. But I had a good time. We uh, finished at the Citadel for now. But that's going to be it. So that means starting next week, we will be taking our, uh, our no new ship, the new command we have, the Normandy, out into the galaxy. So... Anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, thank you guys for checking it out and uh, being here live with me. Um, we'll be going to that something cluster or another looking for... Uh, granted, I don't know all the names, but I, I think I got all the names down pretty much. Uh, Big Blue Titty Lady's Daughter. That's where we go next time. See you back here next week. Bye-bye.